It's just your favorite YouTuber. Are you gonna be? Say that you're gonna be. We gotta turn it sideways. Oh shoot. <laughs> okay. If it Okay, go go on that side bug and pull it in a little bit more. Be careful, be careful. Oh shoot, hold on. Alright, I think we're good. Okay, I'm just gonna put this. Oh geez, I need some air. It is hot. Hi you guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I am Shelly, if you're new here, your new favorite YouTuber. Period. I am Shelly, if you're new, it's your new favorite YouTuber. And if you've already been here, then it's just your favorite YouTuber. Leia and I just, we're leaving Walmart right now that's annoying we're leaving from Walmart because it is officially back to school back to school starts or it's school starts back in two days right what's today Sunday two days. today is Sunday happy Sunday you guys I was contemplating if I wanted to vlog today because I just didn't know like what we were gonna be up to but I'm like you know what whatever let's let's run it back because I remember last year like it's crazy that school is already starting back I remember just last year we went um back to school shopping we were vlogging back to school shopping last year and i'm like it's so crazy that leia is you know just getting so much older i feel like we are like all watching her grow up and so i'm like i just want to vlog i love vlogging having these memories these moments and yeah i know we're gonna look back on her senior year and be like damn she was just going into high school so leia is going into her freshman year in high school it's like a bittersweet thing for me how do you feel leia excited you're excited oh, it's like a bittersweet thing for me as a mom because i remember her first day of kindergarten so for her to be going into her first day of freshman year is like in two days is crazy we have so much going on the next couple of days leah has her dentist appointment milo has his grooming appointment i have a doctor's appointment and then we schedule leah a doctor's appointment for like next week actually so that's not this week but we just finished like buying school supplies and stuff luckily this is in the way but luckily for me leah is such a decent kid like she does not mind reusing like old school supplies and her old backpack and stuff like that so she's like oh no i'm using my same backpack that i had in middle school i'm like period like we are not wasteful i love a non-wasteful girl or what is it unwasteful <laughs> I love a non-wasteful girl like period so yeah so she is using her same backpack she has like a few other school supplies and things like over the years I just bought like extras of things so we have a ton of stuff so all we had to get today were notebooks folders pencils and a calculator 
I can dig it, okay? Works for me. But yeah, so we got that and then we also bought Leah a bike. You guys would have saw we were putting it in the car. We got her a bike. She's been wanting a bike for, or a bigger bike for like the last couple of years she's been asking because she actually likes to go outside and ride her bike. And I remember when she, even just like a couple years ago, she would be like, mom, can I go outside? When all the other kids, there would be like no kids outside. Like she always wanted to go outside and ride her bike. So I would let her go out and like ride in our little subdivision or neighborhood. And we have like a closed in little neighborhood. And so she would just go outside and ride her bike and stuff in the neighborhood. She's been wanting to do that all summer. So she now, so She's been asking her dad and I for a new bike all summer or actually for the last couple of years and her dad was supposed to get it and then we just kept forgetting like we kept I don't know it was just a bunch of stuff so anyway today we were like okay we were in Walmart we were like let's get the bike so we just got her a new bike I will link this bike down below for anyone else who has like a kid or a teen or whatever who likes to go outside and ride bikes because this bike was only $98 it's a good bike and it's a really nice bike I'll show you guys in a little bit but it's a really nice bike and I also wanted to get myself a bike so so that'll be I might have to order my bike and ship it to the house but I want to test out yeah I need to test out like different bikes and see which one I want and then I'm gonna have it shipped to the house because I miss like when I was younger I used to ride bikes all the time so I kind of miss that and I feel like that'll be a nice like bonding experience for Leah and I to go bike riding and stuff together because we do have a bike path so yeah anyway I feel like I just jumped into this vlog super chatty but welcome back to the channel if you haven't already make sure that you are subscribed don't forget to like and comment down below as you're watching let me know your thoughts on the video and all the little funny comments comments and commentary that you guys do I love it so much so don't forget to subscribe like and comment what are we about to oh so I want to run to Trader Joe's really quick because milk, oh yeah you need milk okay actually I'm gonna go to Target because we need to get milk actually I could go to Jewel because I need to get avocados need I need to get avocados I need to get fruit and I also need to get milk so we're gonna go run to Jewel really quick grab the stuff that we need and then I was gonna do Trader Joe's and just get like a couple little things that I like to get from there but I really don't feel like getting rained on and my hair is already a mess or a frizzy mess so let's just run to Jewel really quick and then we'll head home and we will have our little chill night in what do you want for dinner Maybe we should cook. Oh. We gotta eat. We gotta eat. So, yeah. Anyway, see you guys when we get there. Shouts out to you, Leah. You. Oh. Shout out to you. You just saved my car's life. Why you gotta go so hard? Why Leah? you gotta go so soft? Oh. Okay, let's take this just stuff went crazy. Baby, we gotta buy you some ribbon. For what? Cause what is that? Ribbon. Rhythm. Oh. <laughs> Rip me out the plastic, I've been acting brand new. What does that even mean? Rip me out the plastic, I've been acting brand new. Rip me out the plastic, I've been acting brand new. Like, like you've been acting brand new? Like, yeah, I've been acting brand new, rip me out the plastic, like it's new. Rip me out the plastic, I've been acting brand new. Oh, I get it now. I get it. <laughs> I've been I singing love, that. Then I thought it was like I a love bad the thing. innocence, so. Wait, go oh. grab the flowers for me real quick. Oh, it's not about to fall. Or they're gonna fall. Just grab it real quick and put it right here. Right here. Rip me out the plastic, I've been acting brand new. Y'all, she just saw Milo. I just heard her. I got so many things for my school supplies. Like what? 
what? I'm out here. You're out here going where? It's like when I'm in my car, like, it's like when someone gets their car and they're out there. I got my bike and I'm out here. Deuces. I've expressed to y'all so many times how terrified I am of bugs, but I don't know if y'all understand my fear of spiders. It's on a whole nother level. Like I have a mini panic attack every single time. So um, check this out. I don't even know if you can see it on camera. Yup, yes you can. Do you see that right there? Right there. Y'all see that? Why, why is he here? Uh -uh, this ain't gonna work. My cousin was like, don't kill spiders. They get rid of all the other bugs. I'm like, bro. Anyway, we just entered a new week. We got dead flowers. It's time to get a new arrangement going. So let's get rid of this. So I'm gonna light this candle. This one smells so good. I got it from Target. I think it's like 10 bucks. I'll link it. as long as I can keep them alive. The last time that I had some hydrangeas, they died within like two days. So <laughs> they say that you're supposed to change the water every single day to help keep them alive. And then I put ice cubes in the vase, so hopefully that helps. But yeah, oh my God, they're so pretty. They look so luxe. So I think this is gonna be the flower that I keep on this table, so cute. And then this, area right here i don't know why but i'm starting to feel like i don't want the wine rack there anymore but then i don't know what to do with it because i don't have any counter space for it so yeah i don't know we'll figure it out it just doesn't really go with that base unless i change the decor pieces in that base, which i might just change that base all together and get a vase that's um, more neutral and then get those little branches I might do that yeah yeah I might do that but anyway the creamer that I got today I was so excited about this they are already putting out pumpkin spice flavored creamers and just even decor I saw something today at Walmart that said happy Thanksgiving like what we're still in summer but yeah so I got this creamer and I wanted to try it because I've never tried this one before and if you know me, then you know that whenever I get a new creamer, why is it cropped? Okay, I don't know why it's, why it's cropped like that, but whenever I get a new creamer, I like to try it out. So I want to use, actually, I have this little bottle that I've been using. I got this when I was in LA. I went to like a green juice spot. I can't remember the name of it, but they had their juices in like this glass bottle and I cannot find any place or any other place that has bottles that look like this so i've been holding on to this one for dear life i'm gonna make a little coffee so i can try out <laughs> this new creamer it's 
so that's actually not bad but i don't know if i like pumpkin I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this. Maybe if I use my brown sugar cinnamon syrup in here, it will taste so much better because that tastes like fall to me. So I think I would like it better, but I don't know. I could have done without this. I don't know if I should tell you not to waste your money because if you like pumpkin spice, then maybe you would enjoy this, but it, the flavor isn't as bold as I thought it would be. I finally bought more lavender essential oil. And I'm just gonna go overboard just adding some to my little oil diffuser so that i can create a relaxing work environment for myself because i'm about to sit down and finish editing my vlog i really don't understand why this camera is so cropped about to get some work done i'm about to finish editing the vlog that you guys are going to see before you see this one i think i figured out why my camera was so cropped i just changed the setting i know a lot of you guys ask me what my camera settings are on this camera but i usually shoot in 4k on and if you don't know i'm on the what is this <laughs> I don't even know. I think this is the Sony ZV-1. I shoot in 4K majority of the time, so that's why it looks super crisp. And I use the Rode microphone. I'll link all my vlogging equipment down below, but I always get so many questions from you guys asking me what are my camera settings. Like I said, I usually shoot in 4K, but a lot of people don't know this. It also matters what memory card you use. This one is Extreme Plus. The one that I'm shooting on right now, I don't really know what memory card it is but i'll link it down below for anyone interested i know that a lot of people are really like stepping into and jumping into youtube obviously you want your content to be nice and clear and high quality and so no gatekeeping over here i want y'all to know the t so i'm gonna link the two of the memory cards that i have this one as well as the one that i'm shooting with right now i'll link my microphone my camera and my tripod that i'm using so that you guys can have that but like i said i'm about to sit here and edit my vlog which is my getaway vlog and i'm so excited for you guys to see it because it is so i don't know i just feel like it's more me and my element i'm enjoying it so far like just me watching it as i'm editing i really can't wait for you guys to see it why is it so dark why is it so dark i don't know i just want to know but i can't wait for you guys to see it because it's so cute anyway this is about to blow me so i'm gonna finish editing and then i'll check in with you guys in a little bit um, it would have happened so, good night. welcome back today is the first day back to school you guys i cannot believe it i just sent my baby off to high school this morning yeah as you can imagine i was a little bit of a mess but i pulled it together and i sent her off to school she looked so pretty i didn't vlog um this morning because we were kind of just trying to you know get her prepped and stuff for the day but if there are any young ones that are watching me I just want to give you guys a little bit of encouragement for your first day of school. I'm wishing you all the very best as you embark on this new journey going into a new school year. I know that it can be a bit intimidating. I know sometimes it's scary, but I promise you it is not as bad as you think it is. It's not as bad as it may seem. It's not as hard as it may seem. Just try your best, do your best. The most important thing should be making yourself proud. So always make smart choices, do the best you can, and I love you guys so much. I can't believe all the babies are growing up. 
I gave Leia a little bit of a pep talk yesterday and I was basically telling her, you know, cause she's going into high school and I remember the high school years. I remember how hard and I remember it was a bit challenging, you know, making sure that you choose the right friends. I always think about this and I always say this, that you are your child's first influence. What they consume is their second influence and who they hang around is the third. In this society that these kids are growing up in, it's challenging enough. I feel like these kids are really just all trying to find themselves. And so it's just, it's very challenging times. We're, we're faced with very challenging times. It's just so important for us to, as parents, as a community to keep these kids uplifted. And so just make sure every day of this new school year, parents, make sure that you are giving that positive encouragement, positive reinforcement, and kids who may be watching, make sure that you guys are making smart choices. Y'all know that is my phrase that I say to Leah every single day, make smart choices. The choices that you make help to shape the individual that you are becoming. So make smart choices always. Um, but anyway, <laughs> good morning you guys. Just made me a cup of coffee. You guys, this coffee that I've been making with the Stoke Stock whatever cold brew, I think it's Stock. I, no, I think it's Stoke. I think it's Stoke. I think I've been saying it wrong. I think it's Stoke cold brew. But a few of you guys actually reached out to me and told me that you tried out the Stoke cold brew, the unsweetened one. And y'all were like thanking me for the recommendation. And I'm telling y'all, like, I will not steer you wrong. I will not steer you wrong. I will not recommend anything that I do not approve of. And this cold brew is so good but anyway so I mixed it with the caramel macchiato creamer and I used vanilla bean syrup as the base and it is so good I've been putting it in this little bottle because it's easy and quick for on the go I actually have to lay up first day of school Leah left her lunch here so I have to go drop Leah's lunch off at the school actually I'm gonna take Milo Milo has to go and get his grooming appointment is today you guys it's literally eight o'clock on the dot we were up very very early this morning we've been up since five we sent Leah off to school at like 6 20 and my little boy and I have been hanging out a little bit I kind of like pulled myself together a little bit I have a nail appointment later on today my little boy has his grooming appointment today so we're gonna go ahead and drop him off he has to be there by 8 15 so I'm gonna get out of here in a second and go drop him off it's like 10 minutes down the road and then um, I'm excited because I get to come back here and the house is empty for the first time in months you guys the house will be empty it's just be me in here I don't have to hear the clicking of Milo's nails across the <laughs> across the kitchen floor. I don't have to hear running upstairs, back and forth, running up and down the stairs, someone jumping, skipping two stairs down. Like, God, it's gonna be me in this loud ass AC unit. That's it. Oh, I can't lie, I'm looking forward to it. So we're gonna get out of here. We're gonna go and take my little boy to get his haircut. Let me show you guys the before so y'all can see my baby is out here looking like a stray. Let them see you. Let them see you, look at that face. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, he's such a cute face. That's a cute face. Oh, look at my baby. Look at my baby. I bought this little satin pajama set sometime last year. Kind of flowy with the shorts. And then I just have this cardigan thrown over. A lot of you guys asked me about this cardigan. It is from Zara. Y'all know how Zara is, so I can never find a link for it. Really cute to just throw over any outfit. Sunglasses, I got them when we were in Houston from the little sunglass stand. My little moon bag from Gucci. And I just have on these thin gold hoop earrings. I need to fix my hair. My clip is sliding down, I don't know. But this is what I'm wearing to go drop off <laughs> Leah's lunch and drop off my little boy. So yeah, let's go get some stuff done. Hi, good morning. He's, he's currently crying, but he's, <laughs> <laughs> he wants to get out. Uh, Hold on, where's your leash? His leash, hold on, sorry. Oh, no, 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 I grabbed it. I was like, oh, that's gonna suck. Okay. Okay, you ready? You gonna get your hair cut today? You gonna get your hair cut today? Okay. <laughs> okay, so one task done, got Milo dropped off. And he didn't give me a hard time today. I thought he was going to, but he didn't. I think because he heard other dogs in there barking, he didn't feel like he had to give me a hard time about going. He was like excited to go inside or something. I don't know, but I am so happy <laughs> that he's getting his hair cut because those knots in his ears, 
no for those of you who don't know i know i get a lot of questions about what kind of dog milo is milo is a shorty he looks more like a shih tzu where he has like the shih tzu face and the shih tzu hair but he has the yorkie body why well, is this not focused it's so funny because everyone who sees him they're always like what kind of dog is he because he's so small but he has that shih tzu hair he doesn't have the shih tzu body but that's my little baby and i always feel so bad when i drop him off and he starts crying so i'm actually happy that he didn't start crying today we're gonna drop off leah's lunch to the school let me see what does she have in this bag she says she needs a lunch bag though so maybe i should stop and get her a lunch bag i'm actually shocked that she even wants a lunch bag or need said that she needs a lunch bag what is this what kind of lunch what is she bringing i'm gonna stop and get her a lunch bag and then maybe grab her like a small bag of chips and then we will go and drop it off at her school okay I just came from out of Walmart. I think I told you guys. Leah said that she needed a lunch bag, so I went into Walmart. Look at how cute this is with this bright pink and this, but I, I was in there and I was like, is she gonna not like this? Because y'all know, like kids these days, they like something when they're young and then they go through this phase of like, I'm too grown for that or I'm too old for that. And then they like it again. So crazy. Same thing with Leia with her Mike Wazowski. We went to Disneyland one of these times. I went to Disneyland. Leia got a Mike Wazowski backpack. She got to a phase where she was like, not really wanted to wear this Mike Wazowski backpack because she was too old for it. And now she likes it again. So... <laughs> yeah we're at that phase so i'm like is this is she not gonna like this wait this has a storage how cute okay this water bottle so she i bought her so many water bottles but she always breaks them or whatever or loses them something happens to them so i bought her another one against my better judgment bought her another one and this one it's so cute i thought it went so nicely with her backpack like i mean backpack lunch bag so i'm like this will be so cute to go together but like is she gonna like this is she gonna feel like this is too kitty but she's also into hot pink right now anyway whatever so i'm gonna put all of her stuff in here and if she doesn't like it i'll just keep the tags and we could just bring it back later and get one that she does like but this one was 12 dollars, and then this water bottle was only 6.88 that's one thing that i love about walmart you can always get things for a better price because target baby this would have been 22 23 and this would have been 25 because why like target be playing in my face and i need to open my eyes and realize it oh they gave them chips in here okay whatever so i'm just gonna pack her little lunch bag and i think this is this is an insulating lunch bag which is pretty cool they give them pringles i'm gonna put those in here and they give them a little water bottle. I'm gonna put that in here. What else do they give? Oh, they give them two Hershey Kisses. They give mayo. I have never had one of these before. They give mayo, they give a little Kool-Aid packet, two Hershey Kisses, and I also bought, because they had these on sale, and these are Leia's favorite snack. So I bought her these and I'm just gonna because this little thing has storage at the top so I'm just gonna put them in here <laughs> I'm just gonna put those in there so she can have a little snack I haven't had to pack lunch in so long because she you know got to the phase of like I don't need that I can make my own and now I feel like she's gonna like this again I don't know we hope you know what I don't want to crunch them so I'm just gonna put this in here i'm gonna leave the storage sticker sticker up top so she knows that it's in there and then oh and then i also got her a pack of gum because she's one of those one of those girls she loves gum so i got her the extra pack and i'm just gonna put that in there and that's her little lunch bag so cute i hope she likes it <laughs> anyway i'm gonna take this stuff home look at y'all the octo buddy gets my phone like my phone is stuck everywhere all the time okay let's put that away i'm gonna run up to leia's school to go drop this off and then i'm gonna go to the post office because i routed everything to my p.o box because i just felt like it's like a safer option especially like with me putting my life out on the internet it's just safer for me to not have my address online if i don't have to so 
I have to go to my P.O. box because I need to go check my mail and then I'm gonna wait until my little boy until they call and say my little boy is done with his haircut hopefully they don't call me until later I have a nail appointment today at 1 15 which is much later it's only nine o'clock I pretty much got everything done I deep cleaned my bathroom yesterday did the whole upstairs area did my laundry I still have like one load of laundry to do but did most of my laundry yesterday really just got my house in order and so now I don't really have much that needs to be done yesterday Leah had her dentist appointment so we went got that done she got her cleaning and everything we pretty much got everything done I feel so productive I'm so happy like I don't work today so I get the whole day off and then I work like the next two days and then I'm off for the weekend I'm just excited for the upcoming like season and stuff a few of you guys were commenting saying that you can't wait for like my fall content and then I even saw that one of you guys say that you can't wait for vlogmas not y'all excited for vlogmas we're still in August but no it's so funny because I was thinking about vlogmas and I was like planning out content and stuff that I want to do for vlogmas so we got we got some stuff coming up like I'm I'm excited I am I'm excited for all of the content I actually also want to do vlogmas on TikTok so if you're not following me on TikTok make sure that you do follow me because I have like some content ideas coming up that I feel like you guys are going to enjoy I think with with uh, TikTok what I'm going to start doing is just more of like the short form version of what the longer vlogs are since TikTok is more short form content I feel like it's a little bit easier to pump out videos over there so make sure you guys are following me on TikTok so you are staying up to date with me and my life and what I got going on because yeah <laughs> because you just should okay because you just should I don't know I don't have a reason because you just should <laughs> back home I just stopped at my P.O. bar one of you guys actually sent me a package it's from Ebony League Candle Company y'all know I love me a good candle Also, if you guys didn't know, my P.O. box is in my description box down below. If you guys have any goodies that you wanted to send, you can send it to my P.O. box. Okay. Oh, that's so cute. Little card, let's read the card. Hi Shelly, first and foremost, we want to thank you for always creating amazing content. You inspire us to do what we truly love. We couldn't help but notice that you love candles. <laughs> I do. We wanted to send you some of our candles to try. If you are led to share our products, we have a discount code, the league 20 I'll put it on the screen. It allows 20% off any purchase. Again, thank you, and we hope that our candles are a great accessory to your vibe. Love, the Ebony League Candle Company. This is their website right here. And also their Instagram and Facebook is on there as well. Thank you guys so much. This one is Sweet Spot. Oh, that smells so good. This reminds me of my childhood home. It smells, it smells just like my house from when I was growing up. And it has the wooden wick, which if you don't know, my favorite wicks are the wooden wicks. I think I'm gonna put this on the counter. It matches with the matte black vase that's over here. And this one is Ebony Absolute. I like this one, it smells clean. I think I'm gonna put this one in my bedroom. So cute, you guys check them out the ebony league candle company thank you guys so much for sending this over to me and you guys make sure that you check them out actually let's light this one let them see your haircut milo let them see your haircut you guys this is the reality this is the crazy <laughs> can they see your haircut before you mess it up let them see Oh my god. 
So I just got my package from Amazon that I ordered. This one is perfect. Oh my God, I like that it's super sturdy. You guys know that I don't have a TV in my room, so I've really been trying to read more at night and in the morning, early in the morning when I wake up. I don't like to turn the light right on. So this is perfect for when it's like really, really early in the morning. Sometimes I get up at like 4.45. I like to read first thing in the morning and I really wanted a book light instead of having to turn on my closet light. I'll link it in my Amazon storefront under, I have a books um, section on my Amazon storefront. So I'll link it in there. But yeah, you guys, this is super cute and sturdy and I feel like this will be good too for like on the go. It has three different lighting settings. This one I'm assuming is daylight. This one is LED and that one is the warmer light, which is what I like for nighttime. So there's that. And then I also ordered, cause I just can't get enough. I have these in like the smaller pair of silver and then I wanted them in gold, the bigger pair in gold. So I ordered these Bottega Duke earrings. These are also in my storefront under current favorites all the girlies have been getting these earrings because they are just so so cute i got the gold ones i kind of want to wear these today <laughs> these are so cute all right i need to start getting ready for my nail appointment so let's go upstairs so i can do some makeup because what are you doing <laughs> are you hanging out in leah's bed <laughs> Okay, I'll leave you alone. Here I was thinking that I was really obsessed with the silver ones. No, these gold ones hit so different. They are so good. Oh my God. Okay, so I'm getting ready. I need to leave in like five minutes. So I'm just gonna put on some makeup really, really quick if I could find my products. Oh, and I'm trying to do a TikTok at the same time. I just refuse to not get content today. <laughs> I refuse to not be productive today. You guys have seen me do this makeup look a thousand times over, but I know how therapeutic it is to watch people do makeup. And I kind of wish that I had a little Octobuddy situation to sit you guys up over here, but I don't. So here we go. Leaning my little reflective thing up against the tripod so the camera's moving. Y'all, this is, it's, it's very ghetto over here. <laughs> but i have to get content and i'd like for my stuff to look a certain way also a little tip that i have for you guys if you notice that your eyebrows get oily like i'm an oily girl oily combination girl so my eyebrows get very oily within like an hour of me applying product try to do your eyebrows before you do your skincare like before you apply your skincare products and i don't know why but it just makes such a difference so try it out <laughs> So my makeup is done. This is very simple beat. Oh shoot. So for, for my outfit, I'm thinking I could put on this sweatshirt. These shorts, they're just some cream biker shorts. Perfume is Gabrielle by Chanel. This is not my favorite scent at all. I personally don't really care for this scent, but everyone gives me so many compliments on it. So we're gonna wear it today. This crew neck sweatshirt is from H&M. I'll link it. I think they still have it available. My Bottega dupe earrings. I just put this little head thing on because we're having a bad hair day. <laughs> and then these biker shorts are a pretty little thing. The New Balance, I know you guys have said, a few of you guys actually said that you tried to get these and they're sold out in your size. I got them from DSW. I'm sure there are other websites that have them. So I'll try to find them and link them. 
and then I'm wearing my Gucci moon bag and Gucci sunglasses. I don't really know if I like these with this, but anyway, here's the look. I'm gonna go get my nails done. I'm thinking that I wanna do a powder blue, but I always say I wanna do a color and then I never do it, so yeah. Anyway, let's go. All done with my nails. My camera is about to die. My camera's on 4%, but I wanted to show you guys my nails. They are so pretty in blue. I almost did not go with the blue. That was this close. I was about to go with uh, something, but I can't remember. It was like a very pretty, like milky pink. I almost went with that. And I was like, no, stick to what you said. Do something different. Get the blue. And I really like it. And then my toes, I got blue too, but my toes are like a brighter blue and I don't know it just looks more opaque yeah I don't really the color on my toes is eh, it's just all right but the color of my nails is so pretty I know I told y'all that we were Dunkin Girlies but I ended up stopping at Starbucks and got Leia a drink a little refresher and I got myself the cinnamon caramel nitro with light ice and two pumps of white mocha I really went there because I wanted to get Leia a first day of school drink and I know that she hasn't fully converted over to being a Dunkin' girly. She is still a Starbucks girly. So I got that for her, but I'm picking her up right now. I don't know where she is though. Like, girl, come outside. But yeah, I'm picking her up right now. I can't wait to see how her first day of school went. Actually, she's calling me. Hello? You're, Hello? I'm following your location and it's, I don't know how to like get to where you are. I don't oh, know which one I you're just in. moved, I'm, I'm right here. Oh, okay, okay. Wait, my camera's gonna die before she gets in. Her mouth is dropped. <laughs> Why is your mouth dropped like that? You, did you just get Starbucks? Yeah. Did you get me any? No. Oh, I'm, I'm just mind. kidding. I'm just kidding. How was your first day of school? My camera's about to die. It was but so how good. Was it? Yeah. It was good. Yeah. So you had a good first day? Yeah. I've been blue. My Wobby. classes were so like easy to find. And mom, they're literally, I go from, I go from third floor, second floor, second floor, third floor, first floor, first floor, third floor, first floor, first floor. Oh my gosh. So you got to work out today. Okay. And then I didn't go to my locker, so my back was hurting. Did you get your um, lunch? Yes. Did you like the lunch bag? Yeah, it's really cute. Oh, okay. You didn't think it was like... I ate all the goldfish. I ate everything in here. You did? Yep. Did you like the water bottle? Yeah. It, it was separate. You didn't even fill it. No, I didn't because I just bought it from the store and I brought it straight up there. Oh. Yeah. She said you didn't even fill it. Girl. It's much later and of course I switched up my outfit a little bit. These earrings, I'm so obsessed with them. You guys have to get them. They're too good not to, but I switched it up because... Okay. My nails. And this bag, I haven't worn this bag all summer. And this was one of my favorites from last year that I got last year. And so I switched so that I could wear like this denim hat with this bag and my blue nails. So cute. I just took Leia to, um, if you guys don't know if you're new here, Leia coaches the cheer team that she cheered for last year. But since she's in high school now, she doesn't cheer for that same team. So she's gonna be cheering for the high school, but they asked her to junior coach her old cheer team. So I just took her there because they had practice tonight. And I realized you guys, and I'm not proud of this at all, but I haven't eaten anything today. And that's more so because I've been busy all day. It's really no excuse, but I've been busy all day. And then I have had two cups of coffee, which is insane, but probably the reason why I'm like, have the jitters, my heart is racing, I need to do better. But I have been having this bagel with chive and onion cream cheese and a slice of tomato for the last few days. When I stayed out at the cabin, we stopped at this little farmer's market and they had fresh, like big tomatoes. And oh my God, these tomatoes taste so good. So I got some and I've been having them on my bagel every single day. And usually I have it in the morning for breakfast, but today was just an unusual day. First day of school, grooming appointments, nail appointments, and the whole nine. So I didn't get to eat today, but <laughs> I made, last night I made plant-based sloppy joe. That's one of my favorite things to make for the days when, why is it so dark? 
for like the days when Leah has practiced. Yesterday she didn't junior coach, but she had tumbling practice. And so we didn't get home until almost nine. So I made plant-based sloppy joe last night for dinner. I made that last night and I don't really want that for dinner, but Leah says she wants that tonight again. So I'm gonna let her have that tonight, but I don't have to pick her up for another like 40 minutes. So I'm gonna make me a bagel. I say all of that to say, I really want a bagel. <laughs> and don't judge me, judge your mom. It's already seven something. I'm not proud, but this is what I want to eat for dinner. Why is it so cropped? The sun is really doing this thing tonight. It's beaming in here so beautifully. Anyway, we got a plain bagel. Oh shoot, let me toast this. The way I bring this vlog camera everywhere with me, like it's my purse, it's crazy. I got the little indent. I'm about to go pick Leah up from practice and then we're gonna come home. We're gonna start getting ready for tomorrow. We have to be up at five and I work tomorrow. So I want to be in bed by a decent time, do my skincare. I really wanna do the LED mask tonight. I wanna read at least two chapters tonight. I wasn't able to finish a full chapter because i was reading while i was at the nail shop earlier today but i didn't really get to get much reading in yesterday so i want to read two chapters today of the book that i'm reading which is atomic habits i'll have it linked down below that book has me in a chokehold the same way that the audacity to be queen had me in a chokehold and it's also something too that i wanted to talk about with the book there was a guy who came into my job he's a regular he's a regular customer he came into my job one day this was actually the other day, um, the day before yesterday. He was in my job and he saw me with the book, Atomic Habits, and he was like, oh, what are you reading now? And like before when he came in, I was reading The Audacity to Be Queen and I kind of gave him like a little rundown about what the book was about and how I felt like it really helped to transform my way of thinking and which assisted in helping me change my life. So now I'm reading this book and he was asking me what it was about. And so I was telling him and he was like, don't get so caught up in that stuff. Like just live your life. I understand where he was coming from. It's funny because when he said it for a split second, I was like dang am I taking this stuff too seriously and then it was like came back to reality I remembered what I was doing it for I remember where I was where I am where I plan on going and you know etc the thing is when you're an adult you don't have anybody leading the way for you you just have you're just figuring it out you're you're figuring it out when you're younger you have your parents that are like do this do this make sure you do this but when you're an adult you have to do it all on your own you have to figure it all out on your own I figured out what works for me you know I'm figuring out what works for me so to have somebody be like don't don't get too caught up in all that stuff it's like listen this is what's working for me right now if it doesn't work for you cool but this is what's working for me right now and I really need people to normalize not projecting their own ideologies and um, beliefs onto other people like this is my journey I didn't chime in on yours and say because we talk about books and stuff and like I didn't chime in on any of his books and say no you shouldn't be reading fictional stories or whatever I didn't say that I used to read those books when I was younger now I'm, I'm in a different phase in my life that was just something that was really like on my mind and I just want to encourage somebody because I know people love to just you know try to make it seem like you're doing too much to better yourself like it's it doesn't need to be that complex and which it isn't but this is my journey it's not your journey so don't worry about how I'm doing things just focus on your own you know but yeah anyway I just wanted to say that because that was just something that really I was like dude mind your business like I'm not in your way I'm not telling you how to do things at your big age don't worry about me don't tell me about me I got this I got me
Leah bought a sunset lamp. I think she got it off of Shein. I'll ask her exactly where she got it from and link it down below. But this thing is so cool. I was gonna order one for myself, but I'm like, <laughs> forget that. Leah and I can share it. But this is so cool and it, and it just creates the perfect ambiance in my room. She's going to sleep because she has to be up at five, so she let me use it. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm never going to want to give this thing back. It's so cool. But I'm about to do this LED mask. I did a sponsorship with this brand a while ago. I think they changed the name. So I'll try to find this mask and link it down below. But I charged it up because I knew I wanted to use it tonight. It lights up different colors. I'll link my TikTok down below that I did with them, with the video of the sponsorship that I did with them. But I think I'm going to do this yellow. So you just press the button here. The different lights mean something different. I'm going to do green. You just put it on like this and you're supposed to just relax while you have it on. I usually do it for like 20 minutes, but you just wear it like this and just chill until it's time to take up. Oh, Ooh, this one looks so cool, but I want to do green. Oh, this one's cool too. But, um... But like I said, I did a sponsorship with them, with this brand for this mask over on my TikTok a year ago, I think. But I think they changed the name of their company. I'll link the TikTok down below so you guys can get all the information about the mask if you want to purchase it. I've had it for a while and I stopped using it for a while, but then I'm like, I told you guys, I'm <laughs> getting back into really taking extra care of my skin and it is really paying off so yeah i'm just gonna chill in bed i got my book i'm gonna do a little bit of reading with my little reading lamp and i'm gonna call it a night i know this is a weird way to end the vlog but i love you guys so much do not forget to like comment and subscribe <laughs> and i will catch you guys in the next one Mwah. that's so creepy oh my god <laughs>